We got to get changed in these dressing rooms with everybody else. So, I might change put on my costume. I pulled my pants off. And one of the people I was dancing with was like, oh my God, oh my God. I'm like, what? What the hell wrong with you? Mm. Turns out my thing was hanging out my boxers. I'm like, what the? the, the, the I just can't get it. Mm. What's going on, y'all? It's Travo Cordell, and I'm back here with another video. So I was watching B-Love. Y'all know I just didn't watch YouTube all day. And she did a Wendy's Triple Burger versus a Burger King Triple Burger. And she just made it look so good. I'm like, y'all, I got to do it. So that's what I got. You know, I got the lettuce, the tomatoes, the onions. Added bacon. I got the cheese. And I got me some onion rings as well on the side. So I'm going to go ahead and I'm, let me go ahead and get a little thumbnail here. There we go. Time to dig on in. Let me open up my little... I got some onion ring sauce to call it. Zesty sauce. Hope it's good. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. Yeah, I don't know which burger to go for first. Try Wendy's. Mmm. 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 This is really good. And it's juicy. I'm cheap, y'all, so I'm used to getting stuff off dollar menu. When I go to Wendy's, I get the four for four. I'm getting a triple burger. Mmm. Mmm. Y'all, this is gonna be a messy video. I can already see it. Mmm. Come on. Sweet baby Ray. Y'all know how I'm gonna get to the end of it. You gotta beat on the bottle like it's those, huh? It's like dip my burgers in there. You know. And of course, I brought Batman back. With the Hawaiian punch. I don't want to drink too much. I don't want to get full. But. Mm. Mm. Dip that burger. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, this is so good. Look at this bad boy. Yo, my mouth not gonna fit around here. Jeez. Mm. Mmm. Mmm. So I don't eat burgers in y'all for real, for real. Something I did a challenge. But this burger is really good. You can tell it's on the grill. No, I would really do like that. Mmm. Mm. I just don't know which way to go. Mm. Mm. Yeah. So, the topic I have for y'all today, yeah. Oh, I'm on forgot. If you like what I'm doing, 
go ahead like the video give it a thumbs up comment below subscribe so we can be together and hit that bell ding 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 to be notified whenever I drop a new video so you can stay on top of it but mm, mm, mm. I'm sorry y'all this video gonna be messy but the topic I have today is I told y'all I'm silly I'm a goofball we are going to talk about embarrassing moments. Y'all. Mm. And y'all better not just me. Everybody have embarrassing moments. So. One of my embarrassing moments is. I was young. I had to be about 12, maybe 13. Um, I fell asleep in the middle of my mom's floor. And they woke me up out of my sleep because they said I just kept saying Beyonce, Beyonce, oh Beyonce over and over again. And when they woke me up and I stood up, y'all, I was showing. And you know what I mean by showing when, you know, when men show, it was like full throttle. That's embarrassing in front of my whole family. Like, what? <laughs> mm. Fix my burger phone now. I was so embarrassed, y'all. I was just young. Mm. Mm. Whatever was going on in that dream must have been a good dream, but mm. Mm. then mm. one time. I got extremely drunk and I was at one of my friend's house and I, I could feel myself, I'm like crazily drunk and I feel myself having to use the bathroom. So I'm like, oh my God, I got to pee, I got to pee, I'm too drunk to pee. But I sit up and I just, I went to the bathroom. I'm just peeing. So I thought I was in the bathroom, y'all. When I woke up the next morning, come to find out, I had pissed in my friend's dirty clothes hamper. Because I thought I was pissing in the bathroom. I was that drunk. Embarrassing. I told y'all I got so many stories. Mm. Mm. No, whoop, no. Mm. It should be illegal to sell stuff like this, y'all. think of another one. Um, I was working at the movie theater. Now, we would get a $500 bonus if we got someone filming the movie, you know, trying to make a profit of it and sell it out on the streets. You know how they do. So I'm working the concession stand. This guy come up with a big old bag. He's like, yeah, I'm the bootleg man. I'm about to film this movie, blah, blah, blah. And I'm like, is this man really telling me this stuff? Like, is he crazy? Does he not know I work here? So, I'm just entertaining and egging him on. So, I'll get my $500. I'm 
I was a freshman in college. Five hundred dollars sounded like a million. So I'm making him on. He walked away, went to his movie. I went right to my manager. I'm like, this man is trying to bootleg the movie. He told me this, he told me that. So she like her exact words was, oh shit, you about to get paid today. I'm happy. Excuse me. Y'all, we go into the theater. We check his bag, of course. It was a damn oxygen tank. I felt so bad. I was embarrassed. Like, I really just had them follow this man, get security and everything. Because I'm thinking I'm about to get paid. And it was the oxygen tank. That man was just trying to breathe. But it was his fault. Like, he's the one who told me that he's about to bootleg the movie. So, I'm I'm trying to get paid. I reported him. I snitched. Yes, I snitched. And after that, I asked to go home. Because I was just too embarrassed. Mm. I didn't apologize to that man or nothing. I got the hell out of that theater. I was embarrassed. Mm -mm. And I went home. Because he wasn't going to come out that, out that movie and start number with me. Mm -mm. Nope. So I got, I got the hell on. So I guess one good thing came from it. I was able to go home early. But I now I was embarrassed. I'm mad just thinking about it. Mm. 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 Mm -hmm. I really don't know which one I like better. Because that Wendy's burger was good. But this Burger King burger is good. I really don't know. I'm just hoping I can finish it off. Dug it out. Went to the end. Mm. So, I'm going to tell you about another embarrassing moment. So, hmm. I dance. You know, we got to get changed in these dressing rooms with everybody else. So, I'm about to change put on my costume. I pull my pants off. And one of the people I was dancing with was like, oh my God, oh my God. I'm like, what? What the hell wrong with you? Mm. Turns out my thing was hanging out my boxers. I'm like, what the? the, the, the I just can't get it. Mm. I just couldn't get to break. Something embarrassing always happened to me. Then, one time I'm in class, big old lecture hall, y'all. About 60 some students in there. I opened up my laptop so I could take notes. And a video from the night before was playing. And if y'all know what I mean when I say the night before, the night before was playing. And all these, you just hear sounds. And I'm like, no, 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 no. Go off, go off, go off, go off, go off. I'm like, no, why didn't I close out of that website before I closed my computer the night before? Jeez Louise. 
I'm always doing something crazy. Mmm. Mmm. Everybody was looking at me like, hmm? I'm alright. Then they laughing. And I said to like, sorry. I don't know what else y'all want me to say, sorry. Um, I would have left out of class without being embarrassed. However, mm -mm. I needed my attendance points. One gonna get me. I know I'm not the only one with the bears and mamas. So, if y'all judging me, save it. Don't come for me in these comments. Don't come for me in my DMs. That's y'all like to do. I try to tell people all the time, can't anybody come for me, but Jesus, don't judge me there. These onion rings get nasty when they're cold. Just like the nuggets I did with that nugget chest. I think Burger King food is nasty when it gets cold. Well, we're gonna move that out the way. Deuces to the onion rings. But we are on the last bite. I made it through two triple burger. Well, let me not speak so soon. I'm finna it first. Mm. I beat it. I defeated them burgers. I beat it. I defeated them burgers. Y'all, I did not think I was going to be able to do it. Especially looking at that Burger King burger. That was huge. <clears throat> but I finished. And I'm still not full. But I got some snacks in the kitchen that I'm going to eat. Oh, yeah, and if y'all wondering why I wore my bonnet today, I didn't feel like doing my hair because it's like 8.30 at night while I'm filming, probably 9 o'clock. So I'm almost out of my bedtime, but I knew I needed to film because I need to get some more content out. So once again, don't judge me, but I'm going to sign out. Like I said before, if you like what you see or even if you don't like what you see, let me know in the comments below. Shoot me a thumbs up. Subscribe and ding 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 Hit that bell so you'll be notified whenever I drop new content so I can grow with you and we can grow together as a big old family because we the Cordell crew. Now I will see y'all next time with another video. I don't know what that video gonna be. So I'm not even gonna give y'all no false hope. But it will be coming soon. See you all later. Peace.